Hello there ladies and gentlemen, Sigvald here, welcome back to another video. So we got Dark Knight Soul Raids back, and we got uh, Dark Melokard starts back, which you guys should definitely grind for. And I do like this story overall, so let's get into this. I also got some big news, I finally got some lethal attack damage on my Joker. Just gonna have lethal damage from there, we got some lethal damage on the Puppet, and we got some lethal damage from Robin. Hopefully we're not exceeding the lethal damage cap, which I have honestly no idea how much it is exactly. Uh, but yeah, let's see what we can do here. I think previously, and I had far lower passive stats for this, we have level 9 Dark Metal cards and level 4 Dark Metal cards, but I think the best I got on the secondary count was like 1.1 billion. With this man. Also, don't ask why Boss Robin is slightly damaged, that's... Uh, that's a, a story for another day, like I tried the team that I might make a video about on him. Okay, drop that. No, he blocks, this is unlucky. Okay, we got the infinite power, now let's try to keep it. There should be blind now on him. Okay, we got it. I think we're gonna keep it easily. We can super move now. I don't care if he super moves too. It's not gonna damage me too much. Oh, that did actually a bit of damage for a tier 1 bot. Was expecting a bit less, but it's okay, it wasn't... Wasn't really threatening in any way. Just need to get him back to the corner. Bro, this is a long ass map. And I'm gonna be right back more towards the end of the fight, because what I'm effectively gonna do is just press this button multiple times. We're still a bit far from uh, getting the 2 billion damage. I mean, the fight wasn't in the first place at 2 billion. But, uh, yeah, this is only a matter of passive stats at this point. I don't think I can get this Joker to be any better than he already is. Maybe get a pop at level 10 to get one more lethal damage bonus, because it unlocks at level 10. And yeah, this uh, this went well enough, I guess. Pretty, pretty good performance. Let's move on. I haven't used the Just League team in a while, so we might as well give that a go. Did I upgrade the class pass? Yeah, I did upgrade them on these accounts. So we got lethal damage from there, we got some crit damage, and we got cyber here. And Bane. I do have some more... Uh... Do I want to waste them on flash trying to get... Nah, nah, I'm not wasting them on flash. I, I could have tried to get lethal damage on the talent, but nah, bro, I'm using this man as a damage dealer like... Twice a year. So it's not worth it. Normally I would corner push with Cyborg, but if I do that I'm gonna also power drain him and I want to do super move kind of at the same time with him. So what that does is just slow down my super move. Okay, we got him in the corner without him actually backing off into a jump attack at all. Not sure he can though, because some characters don't have the animation that allows them to get out, out of your combo to do that. Robin might be one of them. Bro, I messed up. My bad. My bad here. And I messed up again. Okay, let's chill. Let's calm down. Let's talk about this, man. I really want to get this, this kill here. Don't want to wanna do four fights against a, a boss Robin. Over here I think I messed up because of overconfidence, because yeah, it, it's a rob and uh, it's easy to combo and chop. Now we can get Cyborg in there, because... need to chill. Come on. Yeah, he can't, he can't. He tried to back off into a jump attack there, but he's unable to, he's not fast enough. 
Not because Flash is making any active effort to prevent it. Flash actually has crazy short reach on his basic hits. So he's doing the opposite of preventing it. Yeah, I don't think we're killing this. I think I messed up with this team. That's fine. Okay, come on, shot again. Yeah, if I didn't mess up that many times and that badly, I think we might have had a chance here, but... a uh, nope. This man is not going to die. But I think I could have done it if I played it better, so my bad. Uh, it is what it is. Uh, how much did we get? Okay, 84 left. Not sure I could have done really that much with no mistakes, but uh, whatever. I promise after this fight we're gonna have only one shot. Only, only good teams, okay? We got Black Adam here with uh, no artifact. Good thing I checked. Possibly I might have been able to do this with no artifact, but... Let's just let's just put Papa there, okay? And here we go. Black Adam is actually quite a rare character. He's not that strong, so you don't really care about it. But unless you're playing his uh, arena season, he doesn't really drop from many places, or not that often, at least. Like on both accounts, I don't have any him anywhere to max class ascension. I'm missing a lot of shards on this man. Okay, I think I'm safe to super move here. And we should should kill this guy pretty fast. Like, yeah, health in less than 100 mil, and we're dealing about 5 mil when we get the lucky values. Nah, that's actually exaggeration. Still about 4, 3 to 4 mil. But it should be done soon. There we go. Let's take a look at the rewards that we got for this one. And we got... Wow, just like Batman. I think he's a relatively rare drop, but he's bad and I don't need more shards for him. Oh, okay, so here we have Batman on the Drowned with Kamidogu Dagger. We have Classic Wonder Man and we got John. For a moment I, I was like, why am I doing this? But then I realized, yeah, we can use Classic Wonder Man. This is the only setup. I mean, Crown can use... Crown Batman and Drowned can use uh, Classic Wonder Man too. But other than that, we already max out the crit damage. I was looking at the cat because I like did a little bit of uh, deep cleaning in the kitchen and changed the uh, spot that a lot of the... Uh, how do you call it? I mean, silverware, I think you get what I'm saying, but it's not made of silver. They washed everything, so now they are drying up. So he has a very high chance to, to throw shit down and break it if he's not careful. Okay, we tank this with bat. No, no, I was expecting you could do, 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 do super move. Why you don't do super move? Okay, he's gonna do it eventually. It's fine. Okay.
My bad. I'm really messing up badly today. If I keep messing up, we're not gonna even see the peak performance damage I can get here. Okay, it ended right before we could see the peak value. Okay, we're at 1000% damage buff, come on. Let's not mess it up. Okay, so 49-ish was the peak value. Let's move on to the next fight. Okay, so here we have Raven with uh, Dark Metal cards. We got Raven with Twin Blade, and we got a Silver Catwoman. I usually use Classic Quandraman or Silver Bane for this team to boost Raven up, but since I use those, I mean, I could have put Gold Shazam, I guess, to increase the base attack, but the point is we don't need to. I just need somebody to hold some passive stats. Honestly, not even that, the level 9 Dark Metal cards, Raiden and Raven, would have been fine. Oh, they didn't check to see if she's immune to armor pierce on hits. I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, get Raiden in there. Oh, okay, she's not immune to armor pierce on hits. We're fine. I should be able to do super move and get away with resetting darkness as well, I think. So let's test that out. Yeah, we're fine. A little bit risky, but it's fine. Even if I had to restack all the darkness, it would have been still a one shot. Okay, drop that. Get Raiden back in. And there we go. Let's move on to the last fight. Okay, boys, let's see what the head we get here. Oh no, it's the Last of Us clone again. Yeah, we already saw this, I'm just gonna skip it. Okay, so here we have Zatanna. And uh, Dark Metal cards on EPI and lower level Dark Metal cards on Harley. We're gonna use EPI here as the damage dealer. Just wanna get infinite power going and after we have done that, it is pretty much over. Bro, come on, why, why are you covering so menacingly? How did that swipe down that hit? Come on. Okay, gap close a bit. Get a cannon there. Okay, failed to activate infinite power. Not sure if I needed one more special or... I missed the negative effect? Yeah, I think we missed the negative effect at this point. Ah, oh, this is so trash. Okay, I got it and I immediately lost it because one of the previous negative effects expired. Which is probably gonna happen again. Nah, no, we're fine. Bro, this is annoying. Bring back this is magic swords. I want my goddamn puppet at level 10. Come on, man. I'm tired of this. The comment section screaming in level 1 puppets. Okay, this one, this one pretty well. Pretty, pretty close match, almost, almost didn't kill him. But y'all okay, being said, thanks so much for watching, like it if you liked it, dislike if you liked it, and I'll see you all in the next one. Goodbye!